Good morning, world, and all those in, who inhabit it. I'm out here this morning doing a little um, mental health break on the Dunn's Farm Trail out here in Jennings State Forest. Um, this first section of the trail, which is about nine tenths of a mile, puts you through kind of these pine scrubs, palmettos, as far as the eye can see. So we're coming to the end of this little pine section. And um, there is a parking area out here. So if you wanted to totally cut this section off, you could because once you cross the road up here that's where all the good stuff happens so we come upon this four-way junction so if you go this way you join up on the pioneer trail which continues on i don't know another probably maybe eight miles seven miles we're gonna go we're gonna go backwards actually that's Dunn's Farm. That's Dunn's Farm. That's where we came from. Um, waterfalls, all that kind of stuff. That way. I, I don't know. I think this is going backwards. Other people might think no. It just feels backwards to me. Let's see what we can find. So while I'm not out with our group today, um, there is a thing. Our members seem to like vines and I found this one it's fairly well attached guys not not big enough for swinging but yeah so we're we're coming to the part. They rerouted the uh, Dunn's Farm Trail up this way. Don't know why, but it's a, I like it. Um, but we're coming up to where it picks up the Pioneer Trail again. So the Dunn's Farm intersects the Pioneer Trail a couple places. So if you go that way, you keep following the blue blazes, that's the Pioneer Trail. And uh, yeah, that way Ellis Ford, um, Mule Landing Camp Zone, the Dunn Cemetery, all that way. But we're going to keep going on the shared trail. Yeah, used to, trail used to go that way, so I don't know why they, they rerouted it that way and then up. but. You, you go where the trail takes you, right? I'm also being kind of diligent on keeping my eyes to the ground. Um, seeing a lot more snakes out here lately on the trails and in the water. All right, we're coming up on one of my favorite, favorite sections of the trail. It's a good place to sit down, get a drink. This is Prescott Falls. Put my sticks down. It's a really nice clean water going here. Take a little rest. Get 
hydrated. Wipe some of the sweat off. Decomposing, feeding themselves back into the forest. Shrimp mass is back there. It comes all the way up the trail side. Yeah, she was pretty majestic when she was alive and flourishing. Now she's given back to nature. So when I talk about elevation changes, you know, you're up, you're in Florida. So again, it's nothing major, but this is major for Florida. You just up, up, and away you go. And I guess we can look back down. And yeah, that's what makes this trail fun. So this is Schoolhouse Falls. Let's see, we've gone. 2.98 miles. So not that much further. And now we're coming up to our last little waterfall. Looks like a little lagoon. Duck Pond Falls. Quack, quack. Or you will die. All right. As we're heading out, rain's picking up. Can you hear it? Yeah, it's raining now. You hear it? Raining harder. That's why I wear the brimmed hats. Otherwise, I need windshield wipers for my glasses. All right, well, that's the end of today's adventure out on the beautiful Dunn's Farm Trail. We have reached the end point of our journey. Goodbye until another day. And how are you? to get back to reality, y'all. Have a great day.